Hey, what's going on, Leeds Gym Beast? Matty Ice here from Leeds for Locals. And in uh, this quick video, I just wanted to show you how to connect and integrate your Facebook lead forms directly into Go High Level. I've seen this question come up a few times in the uh, in the Facebook group or whatnot. So I just want to do a quick video showing you how to do it. It's actually pretty easy. It can save you a lot of time as well. So you don't have to download your leads from your Facebook page and then upload them or import them into Go High Level. Uh, Go High, High Level actually has a native integration tool that you can use to connect your uh, your Facebook business page uh, to Go High Level so that it brings those lead forms in and you can just send your leads right into your Go High Level account, put them into your automations, et cetera. All right, so let's get into it. Uh, my only ask guys, as usual, is if you find the video helpful, please smash that like button, make sure you subscribe, uh, make sure you join the Facebook group and also check out the links in the description. Uh, I actually have a couple of tutorials on Facebook ads as well, specifically generating leads using lead forms. So you'll probably be interested in that. And uh, if you don't have Go High Level yet, uh, please go through my affiliate link in the description. It gives you a two week free trial. It really does help support the channel. Really appreciate it. All right. So what we're going to do is, uh, so first, a couple of things. You need to make sure that your Facebook lead form is actually published. I see people make this mistake sometimes, and they're wondering, like, where the heck is it? I, I created it inside of my ads manager, but I don't see it inside of um, Go High Level. So the first thing is to make sure that your ad is actually published. You can, you can turn your ads off. That's fine. But you need to make sure... Uh, so if we go in here, uh, you need to make sure that your Facebook lead form is actually published. It's not in draft mode. And I believe you have to have your ad published as well. Um, that might be incorrect, but I know at the very least you have to have your Facebook lead form published. OK, so uh, assuming that you have that done, uh, what we want to do is inside of Go High Level, we are going to scroll down to settings and then click on integrations. And right here, you're going to want to make sure that you have your Facebook business page connected. All right. Obviously, because that's where your Facebook lead forms live and you need to be connected. Uh, you need to have your Facebook business page connected to go high level so that it can actually bring those lead forms in. All right. So make sure right here under integrations, you have the right uh, Facebook business page connected. All right. You can always change it later if you need to. And uh, you're just, it's just you're going to log into Facebook once you click uh, integrate and then choose the business page you want. OK, when you have that done, you'll notice here. Uh, assuming that you have the the new sidebar right here, because uh, under integrations, uh, like they change some things, but just find you're going to want to find Facebook form fields mapping. All right. So click that. And then right here is where all of your lead forms are going to show up from your Facebook business page that you've that you've created. All right. And then uh, what you want to do is just click on map fields. And just like the you know basic contact info, like first name, email, phone number, things like that should automatically map like this and and be connected but you can always click the drop down menu uh, if it's incorrect uh, you just want to make sure that first name is attached to first name emails email phone numbers phone number etc and then you click save and then your facebook lead form is now connected to go high level however you still want to uh add this as a trigger for your automations i assume you have some type of automation you know email text campaign or whatever so what you're going to want to do next is, uh, so let's go back. We're gonna go to your automations and uh, your workflows is where we're gonna go. All right, and I'll just show you an example here. All right, so you're gonna go to your workflow and you're gonna add a new workflow trigger and you're gonna change this from CRM to Facebook. And then from there, you, you'll see Facebook lead form submitted. You click it, add filters. All right, click in form. And then you're going to find the form that you're using for your Facebook ads. So now, anytime you generate a lead on uh, with your Facebook lead form campaign, it's going to bring that lead, uh, create contact inside of Go High Level, and it's going to add them to however many automations that you want. You just need to make sure that you're adding it as a workflow trigger. Okay. And um, that's pretty much it. It's going to save you a ton of time. You don't have to use Zapier anymore. You don't have to download your leads anymore. Just send them right in to go high level. Boom, you're good to go. All right. So that's it, guys. Uh, I hope this video was helpful. If you have any additional questions or any other go high level tutorials you'd like me to make, something that you're struggling on, uh, please feel free to leave a comment down below. Um, I use go high level all the time. So, uh, you know, I might be able to help you out. Okay. Uh, either way, guys, hope you're crushing it. And I'll talk to you in the next video. Peace.